Hello, hello, everyone, and this is Marina Crispy from Heal Your Heart, Heal Your Body with episode four. Now, today's podcast is just going to be a little different than the rest. There's no plan. There's no script. There's no bullet points. I'm just flying by the seat of my pants on this one because when I was in the Word, I kept feeling it and being tugged and it was in my heart to have this conversation and most of us don't like to talk about this subject or we don't know how to move forward from when this happens in our life and that is suicide when we lose a loved one a close friend or someone in our life to suicide we're angry we're sad we grieve there are so many emotions in the, in the, are going on within us that we don't know how to move forward. And then there's the whole religion part of it. And I know for myself and my family, that when we lost our loved one to suicide, we were taught and raised in church and in Catholic schools that you're going to go to hell in a handbag really fast if you take your own life. That is so far from the truth, my friends. I just want to make this clear. It's so far from the truth. God is a loving God. God is a comforting God. God is a forgiving God. So if your loved one had faith in Jesus Christ, even though they made the most difficult and probably the biggest mistake of their life, he will forgive them. He knows their heart. He knows their heart better than they know their heart. He knows their heart better than you know their heart. And he knows your, their heart better than anyone. He knitted us together in our mother's wombs. He knows every hair on our head. He knows everything about us. So you're probably saying, Marina, is it fair? Why did they do it? They're so selfish. I know, I was there. I'm raising my hand to that. Were they selfish? Or are we selfish? Something to think about, huh? Because we don't know what was going on inside.